In this video we're going to look at how to construct a stem and leaf diagram um, and we're also going to look at how we can calculate the median and the interquartile range um, from a stem and leaf diagram. So we've got a set of data here, um, all the data ranges from the tens to the thirties. So when I'm considering a stem it would seem very sensible that I use tens. So if I have tens and twenties and thirties so I need a key to explain what that means. So I'm just going to do 1, 4 is equal to 14. doesn't really matter what I use. I just need some indication of what's what. So I'm just going to go through and do this in order. So I've got 18, 19, 20, 21, 32 and so on. Uh, and for the moment, I'm not going to worry about the order the state is in. And I'm just going to put in brackets um, at the end here how many bits of data are in each group because it's going to make my life a bit easier. But here I have an unordered stem and leaf diagram, so I'm just going to redraw it, um, but I'm going to draw it so that it is now ordered. So I'm going to use my same, uh, see my same stems here. But I'm going to rewrite 8749 in the correct order, so 4, 7, 8, 9. And then the 2's here, so I have uh, 0, 2, 2, 3, 4, so 0, 2, 2, 3, 4, and 5, 6, 8, which is 8 bits of data. And then finally I've got uh, 0, 1, 5 and 6 which is again 4 bits of data. So that's now my completed stem and leaf diagram which is ordered and has a key. So how can I use this to for instance here find the median and the interquartile range for this data? So I'm going to use my ordered stem and leaf diagram to do it and um, I need all three quartiles so I'm going to work those out first. So Q1 is going to be needed in my calculation of the interquartile range. Uh, so I've got um, 16 bits of data. So 16 over 4 is 4. So I want the 4.5th value. So that's going to be 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5. So between 19 and 20 is going to be 19.5. Q2, a similar process. Um, so 16 over 4 times 2 this time because I want the median. Uh, <coughs> sorry, the median. Um, so that's going to give me here um, 8. So I want the 8.5. Uh, Value. So it's between the 8th and the 9th, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, so between 23 and 24, so 23.5, and then Q3 is 16 over 4 times 3, which is 12, so I want to go to 12.5 value, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. 13, so it's between 28 and 30, so that's 29. So from here, I could now got all the values that I need to do the calculation. So the median is just the value of Q2, which is 23.5. And the interquartile range is Q3 minus Q1, which here is 29 subtract 23.5, which is a 5.5. 